everybody. This is George Ponder for WPCentral.com. Got a uh, video review for you today. This go around taking a look at the Windows Phone 8 application, Camera Pro. Now, Camera Pro, what it does, it pulls all your settings out in the open, where your native camera app has all the settings tucked behind the three-dot menu. Camera Pro throws it all right there on the viewfinder, or most of it, I should say. Layout's fairly simple. You've got your viewfinder, and then you've got eight buttons that access the various settings. Uh, everything from flash controls, auto white balance, your scene modes, can even control the shutter times or exposure times on your Windows Phone camera. You have some grid overlays as well as a level and you also have a compass. Now here's a little quirk with a compass. Go back into the settings button the compass and the settings button, for some reason, they don't play nice. So you really can't access the settings once that compass is displayed, so you're going to have to do away with it. Go back in and access the settings. And while we're here, settings, you've got your general settings, everything from how your buttons act, your preview time, whether you want to show a mini preview or not, autofocus assist light, You've got your self-timer setting, your bracketing, so when you bracket pictures, it gives you the idea of how to separate them. Do you want it one stop, two stop, three stops apart? You've got burst rates, delays, and the number of pictures, as well as a time lapse setting. So there's a lot to uh, Camera Pro. Again, go back into the settings. You can arrange the, the menus. Now, one real quick on the menus, don't get rid of the settings button. When you arrange it, you can always customize this button. Keep it as settings because for whatever reason, I was not able to, when I got rid of the settings button, I wasn't able to find another way to get back into the settings. So just keep that button there. You've got a switch camera mode. You've got still image auto uh, anti-shake mode, burst mode, time-lapse, self-timer, bracketing. So you can change all this. As you can tell, sometimes it takes a little while to initialize the camera. But all in all, Camera Pro, Pro it's, a, it's a nice app for your Windows Phone 8 devices. The downside, there isn't a trial version available. So if you're not really familiar with uh, cameras, it might be a little overwhelming. It would be nice to see a trial version out there so you could try it before you buy it. There's not a help section to describe everything or to get into detail on what you, each setting does. So I, I'd read up on things before I'd invest in, in the uh, full version. Full version's running $2.49. It's available over at the Windows Phone Store. And as always, we'll have the Windows Phone Store links in the post. Have a good one.